Cathedral Cove is one of New Zealand's most popular destinations, but how do you actually visit it? And what are the best ways to see it? The cheapest way to get to Cathedral Cove is to simply just walk there. To get to the walk, you can take a shuttle from the Visitor Car Park in Hahe, which costs $7 for adults, $4 for children, and $14 for a family with two children. From there, it takes about 45 minutes to walk to Cathedral Cove. You can also get there for free by walking along Hahe Beach to the Cathedral Cove Walk. This will take about 30 extra minutes if you start from the Hahe Beach car park. Another way to get to Cathedral Cove is to take a water taxi. This is both the quickest and the easiest way, as all you have to do is head to Hahe Beach near the car park and find the boat in the water. From there, it only takes 10 minutes to get to Cathedral Cove. No bookings are needed for this either. It costs $20 for adults and $15 for children. However, in my opinion, the best way to get to Cathedral Cove is to take a kayak tour. This is what I did when I went there, and the views from the bay were amazing. The tour takes about 3 hours, and it costs $145 for adults and $95 for children. There's also additional pricing options for families. You'll need to be somewhat fit to do this though, because you'll be paddling for a long time and it can get quite exhausting. If you can afford it, I definitely recommend doing this as it's very fun and kayaking through the bright blue water truly gives you a memorable experience. I'd also like to mention that if you want to avoid crowds, the best time to visit is early in the morning. And for the best experience, you want to be there sometime between low and high tide. Also, at the time that I'm making this video, Cathedral Cove is actually closed due to weather events. This means you aren't able to visit the beach at the moment. Luckily, you can still do the kayak tour, just without stopping at the beach. If you're watching in the future, it should hopefully be back open, but make sure to check the link in the description to see if there are any alerts. If this video was useful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more travel inspiration and guides. Go explore the world.